Hello and welcome to more gaming fans. I'm your host Joseph Moore here, and I'm bringing you another week of uh, SQL Draft. Um, I'm using the exact same team as last week or the last uh, week, quote unquote, because uh, I did that battle really late. Um, I'm just kind of using the same thing, so I'm not too worried about winning or losing, honestly. Uh, so let's go ahead and see how this goes. I'm gonna go ahead and lead off with. Uh, I'm gonna lead off with Moon Lady. And no Bunaga. And see what happens. I don't have any like reliable rock moves or anything like that. So it's not going to be great. But you know what? Let's do this. Uh, let's uh, lead Nobunaga and Alola. Then we'll have Discount, Arceus, and Moon Lady in the back. Let's see what he leads. Alright, so good luck, have fun, and uh, most likely enjoy your win. <laughs> uh, I did not prep at all for this team. Um, okay, so we have Gardevoir and the Opposing Dragon on the other side. So I'm just going to go ahead and max here. No reason not to. So max, Dragon with uh ally switch just in case he decides to max dragon as well and we should be faster but we'll see i think it's a speed tie honestly Okay, so we get our ally switch off. So if they're going for Rayquaza, they're not anymore. Ooh, Max Dragon takes that thing out clean. So let's see what uh, Gardevoir was going for. Okay, so just straight up Dazzling Gleam. So it was going to hit us regardless. But luckily we see as we're Dynamaxed, it wasn't too bad. Alright, next up he sends out Volcanion. So I'm going to go ahead and go for... Floral Healing on Nobunaga. As I go for Max Quake on... Volcanion, I didn't see an air balloon, so shouldn't be a problem. And plus, we'll boost our special defense this way. And no matter what, we're healing up because uh, floral healing. So Volcanion is in here. Goes for max guard, which is a really good move on his part. We go Floral Healing, so we're going to get all the way back up. And uh, go for Max Quake, and it doesn't attack. And then, uh, oh, Trick Room. Trick Room is definitely nice. Now, I'm going to go Ally Switch, predicting the Volcanion's hit into uh, Nobunaga here. And I'm just going to go ahead and go for the Max Quake again. And the Trick Room kind of works in our favor, I because uh, we do have, uh, what's his name in the back? Actually went for Max Quake on the Comfey, and that's not going to help him any. 
So now we got a special defense boost as well. We still have Celestia in the back, and uh, as long as we can take out this Volcanion, we should be fine. Um, I'm not sure what I want to do here. I'm just going to go ahead and Earthquake. And I'm going to swap to Moon Lady here. Might be a bad play, but I'm going to do it anyway. Alright, so Dazzling Gleam comes off. Hits Nobunaga pretty well. Max Geyser, who is he going into? Nobunaga as well. Due to our special defense buff, we're living it. Fantastic. And it starts to rain now. Uh, Nobunaga goes for the Earthquake. Let's see if we can take you down to the Volcanion. Just not quite. It was a critical hit, so... I mean, there is that. And we're going to heal up some of that... Uh, what do you call it? Excuse me. We're going to heal up some of that uh, Dazzling Gleam damage. I'm going to go ahead and protect here. Just to uh, be stally, I guess. And go ahead and go for an Earthquake. I should be faster. So Dazzling Gleam isn't going to knock us out here. Moon Lady takes that very well, and we should outslow Volcanion with the Earthquake. And almost takes out Kagame as well. So we get an attack boost for that, and we still have one more turn of Trick Room. That Gardevoir is really slow. <laughs> Alright, now Seaweed is in. Is there still another turn of Trick Room? It seems to be so. Um, we're just going to go ahead and go for the Double Earthquake. No reason not to. See, we goes for Focus Blast into Moon Lady, and that's not going to do much. Dazzling, Dazzling Gleam, of course, goes off, and Nobunaga finally goes down. But Moon Lady, Moon Lady should be able to knock both out with the Earthquake here. And if anything, there's always the next turn. Alright, Dimensions return back to normal. So Moon Lady's gonna be able to... Sorry. Moon Lady's gonna be able to get the knockout here. With Earthquake. So GG for Game 1. Time to go to Game 2. Alright, now this time I think he plays this next round a little differently. Uh, we'll play with same rules, of course. Um, now I think he goes ahead and tries to lead the... Uh, lead the ice. Ice team lead. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and lead Aerodactyl. And um, Celestila. Or even so, I could lead uh, Aerodactyl and Discount Arceus. 
Nah, no reason to play that card yet. We'll just go ahead and go Moon Lady. And we'll bring... We'll bring Nobunaga and... I guess Alola in the back. And you know what, let's bring Discount Arceus in the back. So let's see what it decides to do here. Like I said, I'm really predicting the uh, the snow team. The snow lead, I mean. No reason not to. Game two, got to be aggressive. Nope, it's double legend lead. And moon lady is out here. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and just go for the Earthquake and Protect. Okay, surprised he didn't Dynamax either one there. So Petrie's going to get some good Earthquake damage off. Hopefully take down that Volcanion real low. Oh, not low enough. So Fusion Bolt's going to come off, and we protect it, so we're safe. And Heat Wave also comes off and only affects Petri. So they are really aiming towards that, uh... They're really trying to take out our Celesteela here. So I'm going to go ahead and go for the Iron Head on Nadra. And I'm going to go discount Arceus here. Like I said, snow has to come, so I'm feeling uh, saving that for the back. Get a flinch would be great. Nope, Major goes for Rock Slide. And gets it. Heat Wave also comes off. So Petrie goes down. Okay, well, we're not in a terrible spot here. Uh, we can go ahead and bring Nobunaga in to take down the, uh, the opposing dragon on the other side. Doubt it's running max speed because of the trick room. And discount Arceus can go for the multi-attack into a uh, Volcanion and hopefully take that thing down from this range. Oh, he's going max here. So we might have messed up by not maxing ourselves. But we shall see. So he goes Max Volcanion, which is not as big of a threat to me. In my opinion, at least. So, let's see. Multi-attack would have taken it down. So we do outspeed, go Dragon Claw, and Nadra goes down. Let's see what um, Volcanion's going to do here. Goes for Max Quake and is going to take out our Silvali, which is not too big of a problem. So now we have wasted two turns of his, uh, well, we wasted a turn of his Max. Moon Lady is going to come in here. All right, we got McFlurry coming in. So that's nice. Um, we're going to go ahead and go for the... Uh, should we play it safe? Go for the Max Flare on McFlurry. 
Um, we're gonna have to take a big hit on Moon Lady. We can protect though. Yeah, let's do that. We're gonna go Max Flare and protect. We should be able to take the hit on Celestila. But we do want that Vanellix out of the way. Hopefully it's not sashed. And most likely is. Because it's going to try to get Veil up. But we'll see. Okay. Better. Volcanion just goes max guard there. We go ahead and get our protect off. Uh, max Flare is going to come off. Change the weather. So even if he does go Veil... And lives on the focus dash. It's not going to matter. Oh, it just lived. I wonder if it was sash, though. Alright, so now we are safe to just go ahead and take out that Volcanion with the Max Quake here. And um, we can go ahead and just Earthquake. Alright, Ice Shard comes off. Last ditch effort uh, is not going to matter. Max Quake comes off and hopefully takes down this Volcanion here. It should. And it does. So Volcanion is down. Uh, Vanellix is about to go down to Earthquake. And uh, told you snow was coming in the back. But luckily, we had Max Flare, so that's not going to happen. That's, I mean, it's not going to affect us. And Sanic is in, and uh, is going to go down to us, uh, double attacking it. So we're just going to go ahead and go for the Max Flare here. And if it's sashed, it'll go down to the Earthquake behind it. Oh, he just up and quit. So, uh, that's it. GG to you, Sunak, and, uh, thanks for the battles.